Hey boys and girls, welcome to another super exciting outrageous toy review. Today we're taking a look at a bunch of Lego Disney minifigures. We've got a bunch of blind bags here. We're going to open them up and see which characters we get. On the front of the package here it says there's 18 characters to collect. Alright, let's get them opened up. Oh, we got the genie from Aladdin. Oh, I love it. He doesn't have traditional... He doesn't have traditional Lego feet. That's great. He's got his little genie tail there. He's got his face. He's got a hat that contains his ears there. And you plug his hair into that. The genie comes with a little lamp there. And I love that he's not a traditional figure where he has that little genie base for his legs there instead. That's so awesome. Really well done. Well, let's take a look at the pamphlet real quick. Shows off all the characters in the line that you could get here. We have Stitch, we have the Alien from Toy Story, we have Buzz, Aladdin, the Genie, Maleficent, Alice, Cheshire Cat, Daisy Duck, Donald Duck, Minnie Mouse, Mickey Mouse, Mr. Incredible, Syndrome, Peter Pan, Captain Hook, Ursula, and Ariel. It's a pretty good selection. Oh, we got Mickey Mouse! <laughs> Gosh! Thanks for opening me up there! <laughs> Mickey feels a little bit generic. He just kind of feels like a regular Lego man with a Mickey head stuck on top. Um, I, don't, I don't know what I would have given him as an accessory, but uh, he just feels a little bit bland. I, I am glad they painted his legs to look like his shorts with the buttons on them and everything. But he just feels a little bit basic. I mean, he's a classic. You gotta get him. It's a Disney line. Bag number three. I really want Buzz, and I really want the Cheshire Cat. Mr. Incredible! Here's Mr. Incredible. He's a pretty basic looking Lego guy, but I do like his hair piece there a lot. And they did give him an accessory there. It's a little doing our part sign or poster or whatever that is. So that's kind of fun. Oh, yes! The alien from Toy Story. Oh, the claw! The alien from Toy Story has that great three-eyed head. He's got his Pizza Planet logo there on his chest, which always reminded me a lot of the Space Lego logo from the early days. And he comes with a set of short legs. Oh, another genie. You ain't never had a friend like me. Boo! Oh, we got Syndrome. Here's Syndrome, the bad guy from Incredibles. He's got his big S logo on his chest. I love his hair, this, this heat miser flame hair style that he's got is so awesome looking and then he comes with a little brick here that has a blueprint for his little spider like machine so that's pretty cool his hair is so awesome two left and i don't have buzz and i don't have the cheshire cat yet s to infinity and beyond buzz lightyear space ranger this figure is awesome it's really really good he's got this whole add-on piece to give him that bulked out chest. He's got the clear dome piece. He's got the little wings that attach to him. Just a ton of fun. I really like this Buzz Lightyear figure. One to go. Peter Pan. And Peter Pan. I don't think he's supposed to come with two knives, but somehow mine came with two. They were still connected to each other. But he's a pretty good Lego figure. I really like the head sculpt with the hat and the hair sticking out of it with the uh, elf type ears. He's a pretty fun figure. They've been painted on the little, um, you know, the long shirt tail there over his tights, which I think turned out great. In the comments below, let me know who your favorite Disney Lego minifig is. Thanks for watching this super exciting, outrageous toy review. Make sure to hit that like button, subscribe, and check out our other videos.